Fat Storage 101, understanding ectopic fat is the first step towards reclaiming your metabolic health. Did you know that not all fat in your body is created equal? Understanding where your body stores fat is crucial for managing your metabolic health. Let's break down the three main compartments where fat resides. Number one, subcutaneous fat, fat under the skin. Number two, visceral fat, fat deep in the abdomen between organs. And number three, ectopic fat, fat within organs like the liver and pancreas. The latter two, visceral and ectopic fat, they tend to go hand in hand. People with a large amount of visceral fat generally have a high amount of ectopic fat. And these are the most dangerous forms of fat that send our metabolic health into a downward spiral. Where does the visceral and ectopic fat come from in the first place? It's now well understood that each of us have what's known as a personal fat threshold. This threshold determines how much fat we can store in the subcutaneous fat compartment, fat under our skin. Some of us, due to genetics and environmental factors, can store more fat in this compartment, whereas others, again, due to a combination of genetics and environment, have less capacity to store fat under their skin, less ability for their subcutaneous fat cells to expand, and therefore at a given body fatness will store more fat in and around their organs, ectopic and visceral fat. So the driver of ectopic fat and visceral fat is an energy surplus, excessive calories, within the context of having no more room to store subcutaneous fat. Once that subcutaneous fat storage compartment is full, i.e. you have reached your personal fat threshold, excess energy goes central into and around our organs. 